Hey everyone, so, um, <clears throat> sorry in advance if you hear noises in the background. Um, I'm, I don't live alone, so. Um, anyway, today I was gonna do a real time video while, um, I talk, um, so I, well, I just while I talk about things. Um, um, since it's May, I'm gonna, I'm gonna draw a bunch of mermaids in my, in my sketchbook. Um, <clears throat> so, let's get started. So, I, um, I wanted to talk about, um, what's been going on, and it might interrupt my video every other week uh, schedule and I'm gonna try not I'm gonna try not to let it um, interfere I don't know if you guys can see <laughs> maybe I'll try drawing darker uh, you guys can see okay um Okay, so I have been, I know I've complained in other, in other videos about these weird um, neurological symptoms. Um, anyway, I have a, a diagnosis now. It's, um, it's, it's called um, M.E. CFS, it's um, myalgic encephalomyelitis, or um, it's been called, uh, most people would know it as chronic fatigue syndrome. And I also have, anyway, um, I, it's also um, fibromyalgia, which most people have heard of. Um, but that, yeah, that's, it makes me really, making me really tired and that, that explains the, the pain and everything. Um. <clears throat> uh. But that's not my uh, only diagnosis I've had. Um. I've, I've, well, I haven't really talked about it on my channel before. I've alluded to it, but I haven't. But, um, it's a very stigmatized disease. Um, that I've been, you know, ridiculed and a lot of people don't believe in it. But, you know, the government believes in it. And I'm on, I have disability benefits because of it. But it's, um, it's called multiple chemical sensitivity. MCS for short. It's, I mean, I've talked about how I can't handle, um, um, like the alcohol markers or oil paints, acrylic paints, <laughs> how, um, and depending on the watercolor brand, um, but it's like the chemicals in them make me really... Um, I mean, the, the chemicals in, and, and most, like, perfume and, and stuff like that. Um, yeah, the, so the chemicals in perfume and, like, laundry products, deodorant, cleaning products, you name it, um, they, they make me really sick, um. Thumbs on the other side. Um, anyway, that's, I've had that this for ten, ten years. Well, I was diagnosed in 2010, but I've been suffering with it for quite a while beforehand. So I'd say I've had it for, well, ten years, so. This makes more sense. So, um. 
yeah, it gives me, like, I have asthma because of it, and it, so yeah, the perfume chemicals, um, I mean, I know, like, lots of people get, um, like, th there, there's a lot of us, like, just in, uh, in Ontario where I live, there's, like, 400, over 400,000 people with just the chemical sensitivity. That's, that's quite a lot of people. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, that, and I've, 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 I've lived with it for 10 years, so I know how to, I, I've known how to deal with it, and it's not, you know, I just stay at home and avoid people with, uh, well, avoid people. <laughs> um, and, and products and, and all that stuff. So I've, um, I already know how to deal with that. But this new, uh, I mean, the, the ME or, or chronic fatigue syndrome, it's, uh, and it is, it is much worse because it affects me. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it, it just, does, it, it doesn't matter if, uh, I, you know, I've been exposed to um, people's uh, chemicals and stuff, it uh, affects me anyway. <laughs> I didn't want her to be praying. <laughs> it looks like she's praying. Hmm. Well. Um. Yeah, I'm doing the real time thing today because it won't be as hard to edit. It won't be as like energy draining to edit. <laughs> He's here <laughs> and a shirt of some kind. I don't know. When I think of mermaids, I'm like. Underwater, it's like, would they even bother? <laughs> would they even bother to wear shirts? But then, then I guess they're half human, so if humans would wear shirts. <laughs> um, let's give her some. I drew it last year, I drew it um, with uh, like seaweed going around her as, a, as like a shirt. But anyways, so, so the um, the chronic fatigue syndrome or ME, it's called now. It might you know, interfere with my, like today or all week. I'm like crap. I need a video for Friday. <laughs> Need a video for Friday. I need to practice hands. Big time. <laughs> oh, here. Um. <clears throat> yeah, I get like really bad muscle pain and just like exhausted. Like if you. Like when if you like exercised too much, and then that that sort of um, like, yeah, that feeling when you when you've overdone it exercising, but for me it's uh, doing just barely anything. Like normal stuff people do every day, and then it just leaves me like completely wiped out. And then, well, the the, the fibromyalgia explains like I get like nerve. It's like it feels like nerve pain, um, but like 
burning tank like yeah just it, it's it's random just the random pain in everywhere and it's it's, it's not always the same and, yeah and uh, in well pretty much everywhere these like it says if you have one of them you're more than likely to have one of the others and I got all three of these um, this these un well they're very misunderstood and no one really like they don't know the cause um, cuz um, and it, there's no research money um, these diseases don't don't get any research money and yet our numbers are bigger than people with MS and um, certain types of cancer and, and things like there's more of us than and yet they get big chunks of research dollars like funded like the government funded research dollars they get like I mean yeah those diseases need the research money but I mean they could split it up more evenly and give research money to fibromyalgia um, ME and MCS like um, yeah we, we kind of need some right, um, I guess I'm done with this mermaid I guess <laughs> her face is really eh warm up. <laughs> I've been drawing a lot on my tablet. My um my new iPad. So kind of it's a little rusty with the uh, pencil and paper. Um but yeah they're very misunderstood illnesses simply because there hasn't been any re there hasn't the only research that's been done is like um like private research I guess anyway um yeah so uh, just actually I'll probably just end it here uh, well I'll draw one more mermaid uh, I'll draw a male mermaid I'll draw a merman this time. And then figure out what else to talk about. <laughs> Check it, it's like you guys can't really see what I'm doing. Even the sultry expression. Um, some longer curly hair. Yeah, like talking too much makes my my jaw and uh, my tongue. <laughs> it, it makes my jaw, my tongue, and, and all that um, go numb. When burnt, like burning, makes like my mouth feels like I burnt, like I burnt my mouth on something hot. Uh, I think it's pretty 
Room higher up on the page. Oh. <clears throat> and then I have like a sore throat for a couple days if I've done too much talking. To, um, to keep up with my two, two videos, well, I mean, well, roughly two videos a month, but video every, every two weeks, or like every other week, I'm gonna tr try my best to stick with that, but if, um, I feel really bad if I didn't, but uh, <clears throat> I'll try. But if if I if if I miss a week, it's probably probably because um uh, you know not feeling the greatest. <clears throat> anyway, I barely, barely talked about it, but um, <clears throat> that's what I want to make this video about, and I've just basically said what I have. Um, if anyone's interested, I'll, I'll leave some links in the description. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave some links to some like info pages or something. Way too big. <clears throat> what else? <laughs> yeah, I'll leave some links in the description to some info on the what I got Please be, uh, I mean, I barely get comments, but please be nice in the comments. I mean, I've, uh, there's lots of people with this, with these diseases, and you know what, it, and it doesn't matter if, um, Like, I've dealt with horrible people, horrible people who don't believe, who don't believe in my illness and they, and they, they, um, mock, ridicule, and just are overall just assholes. And, um, you know, it, 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 it doesn't matter if, if uh, people don't believe in it. They're real, they exist, a lot of people are suffering with them, and... Yeah, it doesn't matter if 
if you don't believe in it. Um, you know, just people just shouldn't like people. Um, there's so many diseases that people didn't believe in made and and um, you know that they just made. Um, made the people who had them feel horrible and like it was all in their head and and all that before they <laughs> Excuse me um, Before they actually um, Did research on it and discovered you know the You know the, the, the disease mechanism behind them and Then you know oh, yeah, they're, they're it's a real thing you know, and then a treatable medical condition, like everything in the past had, like most all these other, these diseases have all been like that the people suffering from suffer from everyone's um, ridicule and disbelief until they're proven and I mean these diseases are proven but um, yeah, again, research is, uh, lacking. So yeah, don't, don't, I, I, I really hate when people are assholes when they don't believe something someone else is going through. <clears throat> it's just, it's kicking someone when they're down. And I just, I, I wish people weren't, wouldn't be like that. So anyway, that's, that's my second mermaid, or man. <laughs> the dream higher, went to get off the page. Uh, here's um, the first one I did. Last 20 minute video. <laughs> but yeah, so, um, <sighs> anyway. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening to me sort of ramble. I didn't, you know, script anything. Yeah. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.